I'm just Jackie is here and I'm here at beautifuls it is actually Christmas Day Merry Christmas happy Kwanzaa happy Hanukkah whatever my beautiful celebrate out there happy holidays so I'm here because I'm trying to kill two birds with one stone okay um in my previous haul video I had hauled the shape tape from Tarte and I hauled this sponge this beauty sponge from um, Real Techniques and I was asked you know to let my beautifuls know how I feel about it so basically it's gonna, this is going to be like a first impressions video okay now I'm not going to beat this face y'all I'm too tired to beat this face okay so as you can see I already did my eyebrows I'm just prepping my lips and I'm wearing BB cream today I'm not doing a foundation I don't feel like it and the BB cream of choice today was the CoverGirl Queen. And the color is, doo -doo 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 -doo. I don't know, Q640. Sheer Espresso. That's the color of choice today. Okay, so I'm already at the point where I want to do my under eye highlight. So I'm going to use the shape tape and I'm going to blend it out with the Real Techniques. And you see me looking over here using my handy dandy mirror so first of all I absolutely adore this packaging adore um, there is oh how many ounces in here y'all I don't know and I already threw the uh, you already tossed the box right off, on it's a lot um, check out this applicator I've never seen an applicator this freaking thick mad crazy okay so let's get it let's go y'all i'm in my mirror hand it in the mirror so i'm just gonna apply like so i will say it feels awesome it feels amazing on it just yeah it feels good on all right i just don't I'm just putting it up in a light and I'm just uh, maybe it's so lightweight it feels empty <laughs> okay uh, like the packaging is super duper cute and it feels great it feels super creamy alright let me just come down here Get this nose, the lip. I don't feel. I mean, okay. Let me just finish what I'm doing. For as big as this applicator is, I feel like I shouldn't have to keep dipping. You know what I'm saying? I'm just wetting up my sponge. I feel like I shouldn't have to keep dipping to get this um whatever applicator but I'm using this real technique to blend out sponge feels soft too I like the like the way the sponge feels the main reason why I got this sponge is because of this diamond shape and I want to get it right up under my under eye okay and yeah it blends effortlessly I will say that too hmm definitely blends effortlessly yeah. Let me look at my mirror real quick. Let's see what we got popping. Ooh. Definitely like how it blends. It melts into the skin too. Yeah. 
definitely like that. So, I'm going to take my Sasha Cosmetics and apply some powder. I don't bake. It just sits long enough till I finish powdering everything I want to powder. And then I dust it off. Alright. Shit everywhere, y'all. Y'all know how I go. Don't never, nothing ever go right when you're on camera. So, I'm just going to dust it off. I got some on my brows. I need to fix that. Uh, baby. So far, so good. I like how it looks even after, you know, after I powder. Because sometimes I hate it when it creases. I hate it when it creases and hopefully I don't figure out a good technique to keep stuff from creasing under my eye. Okay, so. But yeah, I'm so far so good, beautiful, you know. Can't complain. What y'all think? What y'all think? Oh, the light ain't too bright for y'all, but. Hmm. Make it do what it do. Alright, so. Finish that off. Like I said, I'm not doing a. Y'all, I ain't trying to do much to this face today. So. Um. Yeah, let me um contour and stuff. And then I'll I'll come back. Okay. Okay, beautifuls. I am back. I am done with this face. As you can see, I ain't do much at all. I'm gonna let this red lip and this wing do its thing. So at the end of the day, um First impressions, right? That's what I'm doing. First impressions. So, first impressions is I actually like the way the shape tape feels. It blends effortlessly. I just want to see how it's going to hold up for a few hours because I know sometimes um, <sighs> certain concealers I use who after a long day. It looks tired and broken up and all the pieces. So, I'm just going to see how this holds up after going to visit some family and friends today. And then I'll come back. And, you know, y'all can see for yourself how the face held up. As for this Real Techniques um, Diamond Shape Blender, I actually like it. You can get right up in there without messing anything up. Um, you can use a flat part for your your face to um, blend your foundation you got so many sides to use um if you wanted to i could have took a side and did my my nose highlight i mean it's just so many options and sides for this thing so i mean i like it i like it's super soft i love it you're definitely going to get your money's worth I, you know, you guys saw the haul. It was buy one, get one 50% off. Then plus I already had a, another discount. But regular price for this thing, I believe, is $9.99. But right now, um, Ulta has a sale going on. Buy one, get one half off. And, um, but yeah, um, I love it. You know, so beautiful. Thanks for asking me to, you know, come back and check in and let y'all know how I'm feeling about the sponge. If anybody wants to know what's on this lip, mm, <sighs> this is blessed. From Fontella Cosmetics that I hauled in my first um, haul video. Mm, look at this red lippy, y'all. Let me tell y'all something. I love these two Fontella lipsticks that I have. This is my first time wearing Blessed, you know. But that Prestige, I wore that thing all day. It felt great all day. It didn't chip. It didn't, it didn't make my lips peel. 
my lips actually felt moisturized all day but you know that's a whole nother sidebar to the sidebar but i told my beautifuls i wanted to come back and let you know how i'm feeling about these items that i've been hauling no need to haul if i ain't gonna come back and give y'all <laughs> the what's the 411 on it right so yeah beautifuls happy holidays and yeah i'll, I'll check in you know before i close this video out and let y'all know how um you know the shape tape held out throughout the day all right be back beautiful i am back i am here i am hot flashing so i'm just gonna <sighs> use some of my uh what do you call it my blotter man because shining 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 yeah okay so anyway all of this winning so anyway Yes, I'm here. I'm back. It's like 8.30ish. I'm about to wash this face off. But I wanted to come back up here and tell my beautifuls what I thought about the Tarte Shape Tape. First of all, y'all already saw how it applied like butter. Y'all saw me blend it out effortlessly with the Real Techniques um, blender, that diamond shape one. And speaking of that, if I can find it shoot y'all y'all should see my makeup table but anyway speaking of that blender i like that blender um yeah i would recommend that blender as i said earlier you know so not too much more i can say about that blender i mean would what i say go pay ten dollars for it no would I say go catch it on sale or use a coupon? Yes. Okay. But it is a good product. Multi-purpose, multifunctional, many sides to it. I think that's the cool part about it. Because the regular ones, they just got this to it. You know, but like I said, the diamond one has more sides to it. Oh, here it go. <laughs> the diamond one has more sides to it. It's more, more functionality. Anyway. Sidebar to the sidebar. Let's get back to this. Um, I love the colorfulness of this. It could have just been a plain old whatever silver gold. But I love that they they did a design with it. I'm absolutely pleased as punch that it's an exclusive at Ulta. Because I know I got a lot of Sephora girls up there out there. But this is exclusive at Ulta. Okay. Um, normal price is $27. But I got it for a deal i got it for twenty dollars because i had coupons and whatnot and um yeah <sighs> i don't know i don't know how many fluid ounces this is because i threw the packaging away but y'all can see let me all right like this is the rihanna fenty and i'm just sizing it up with it okay for those of you who have that uh again here is a mac lipstick i'm gonna size it up with that how about that see there about the height of a mac lipstick tube okay yeah so anywho like i said went on like butter smooth creamy everything um i like this thick i like this thick applicator i don't know what the dealio is you know what i like this i like this thick applicator okay because it, it don't take much to get the coverage you're looking for when you apply it. Those little skinny, skimpy looking brushes and stuff. Yeah, you got to keep... Yeah, so this is a nice applicator. I like it and everything. Um, but like I was saying earlier in the video, I shouldn't have to keep dipping it. But I don't know. Maybe that's just... I don't know. I don't know. But whatever. I just... But I, again, I feel like there's no product in here. It's just it's this is how lightweight and airy this damn thing feels. But I know it's product in here because trust me, I put it up to the light and I can't see through it yet. Like my NARS creamy concealer, like this right here, I put I put it up to the light. I can see all the way through it. <laughs> She's empty, empty, done. It's a wrap. Okay, but um, speaking of NARS. Speaking of this NARS, I will say compared to NARS, I, I like the texture of this more, I don't know, 
um, I think it's thicker than the NARS. I think. Or maybe it's just creamier than the NARS. Well, it's definitely creamier than the NARS. I'm going to have to go with it's thicker, too. I just like the... I think it just feels more creamier and thicker than the NARS. You know, you know, we all said that this NARS is really creamy, which it is. But this thing is giving me whipped. Y'all you know what I'm saying? But anyway, at the end of the day, I like this shape tape. And... The color that I have is deep, and I'm just going to swatch it on my hand real quick so y'all can really see the color again. It's deep. I don't go like two, three shades lighter than my complexion. That's not that's not how I do my under eye highlight. No, I go like one shade lighter than my, you know my skin tone and now and we good to go okay so beautifuls again yeah please forgive the hmm of the video i'm here but not here but i'm trying to be here how like christmas hard for me y'all it's hard but this christmas was better then, yeah, it's, this has been the best Christmas I had in a long time, okay? So, anywho, beautifuls, hope you enjoyed this brief review, first impressions, whatever. Go get it for yourself. If you get it, let me know you got it. Let me know what you think about it. See if we feel the same way. But I definitely say it's worth the coin. See, here's the thing. Once I find something that I like, I just pretty much stick with it. I never used that NARS for my under eye. I tried it one time. That was enough to let me know that this that that particular concealer is not made for, for me and my highlighting of the you know middle of my face. You know, I just use it for brow bone. Okay. And my like I said, my the MAC Pro Longwear, that is my holy grail for under eye never fails but this is bomb too i will say that this is bomb too both the mac and the shape tape their price points are pretty much the same so yeah but definitely like this glad i purchased it worth the worth the money i spent on it and i'm glad i got it for only twenty dollars so if y'all can get it on sale get it on sale but yeah beautifuls holla at me this is